first off, congratulations. Thank you. And secondly, what was the strategy? What was the approach, and did it work as you'd planned? Yeah, I just wanted to tuck in the first 5K, just kind of relax, because I had a race coming up tomorrow. So I just tucked in, and then when I felt you know ready to go, I just went for it. And I didn't really try to push the pace until like the last 600, just to conserve my energy for tomorrow. Uh, I was, I was going to say, were you aware of where the, the guy who was, I think, from the University of Albany, may have been a step or two behind you, were you aware of him, or is you simply running yeah. the race you want to run? Yeah, I mean, I was aware of, like, the competitors. It, you know, I, I just kind of, like, just ran with him myself and just didn't really worry too much about what was going on, just lap by lap, just, yeah, just stay comfortable. You kind of run with the confidence that you know if challenged, you can handle it? Yeah, definitely. I... You know, I've, I've done this for like five years now, so I'm pretty confident with everything I've been doing. I've done all the trading, and yeah, I have the speed, so yeah, I, I knew I had it in the tank. Is it about endurance, or is it, is it about speed? Yeah, it's about uh, dirt and speed. Uh, you got to be able to kick at the last 600, and, you know, I, I was able to kind of close a little bit harder the last 400 and stay relaxed, you know, at the same time because I didn't want to push it too hard because I have a race tomorrow. Is so, that speed something that has developed kind of over the years yeah it's developed a little bit you know i've never been much of a like speedster to be honest but you know gary puts us in like 400 workouts and we do a bunch of strides after runs and stuff so you know it, it's it's good to work on your weaknesses because if you work on your weakness you can become an even stronger runner so <laughs> for you and you know we talked about distance runners having at some point to fight through the pain in a yeah. race like that, was there a point you had to fight through the pain? Uh, I mean, not really. I, I think it was just be just trying to get through the race. It, 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 if you forget how long the race is when you run 10K, you're on the track for a long time. And um, I just wanted to kind of get it over with. Uh, just, you know, it's, it's a long race. So that, that was kind of painful for me. And I, honestly, I felt pretty comfortable the whole way through. You say it's a long race. What do you think about while you're running? Uh, I just think about trying to stick as comfortable and relaxed as possible and maybe just yeah, enjoy, the, enjoy the scenery around me, take it all in and just have fun with it. You know? I think so. we all had fun watching as well. Paul, thank you and congratulations. Yeah, thank you. <laughs>